ahead this morning in Amherst is about to be blue and white this weekend. The Buffalo Niagara Scottish Festival kicks off tomorrow at the Hyatt Place, Buffalo Amherst. So this morning we're giving you a sneak peek. 7 Eyewitness News reporter Tui Nugent live in Amherst showing it off this morning. Good morning, Ed and Katie. A lot to get ready for this weekend here at the Buffalo Niagara Heritage Village. We've got some people who are so kind to wake up so early with us, and it's still dark, but yeah, you are here and you're awake. You are the executive director of the Buffalo Niagara Heritage Village. Tell us a little bit about what's going on this weekend. Oh, thanks so much for coming. Yeah. So the 34th annual Buffalo Niagara Scottish Festival. People from all over America and Canada will be here celebrating Scottish and cult, uh, Celtic culture. Uh, so it's literally a gathering of Scottish clans, of, of Scottish pipes and drums bands, uh, Celtic bands, foodie experience. We're even adding something called a Kirking of the Tartans, which is a, a church service on Sunday morning. So there's really so much to do. Fantastic. And Lou, one of the big draws is, you know, all of the heavy games that you're yes. playing. Tell us a little bit about that. Uh, we have got 60 athletes from Ontario, Canada, Pennsylvania, all over Western York coming, some of the best athletes in the area. We've got 60 of them over two days. We'll be doing nine events on both days. These are some of the implements. We do two stones, two hammers, two weights for distance, a weight for height, a bag of hay we pitch over bar with a pitchfork, and the iconic caber toss. Also, a Buffalo Heavies, that's the group that's running this. Uh, we have our specialty. We start off each day with a flaming caber toss. That's our Olympic torch that gets the day started. Fantastic. So much to look forward to, including a different food, celebrating the culture here. And really, this happens Saturday and Sunday from 10 to 9 on Saturday. Correct. 10 to 8 on Sunday. And we've got all the details and the ticket prices for you on our website right now at WKBW.com. But stay with us because we've got a lot to talk about. Hopefully the sun comes up so we can show you a little more. We're live in Amherst this morning. I'm Twila Nugent, 7 Eyewitness News. A